choosing how to go when you're gone isn't always a matter of picking between burial and cremation. In fact, growing numbers are donating their bodies for scientific research. It seems very noble. In fact, it's often done with the understanding that it will go to research the illness that took the life. However, 33 families are now suing the Biological Resource Center and its former owner, Stephen Gore, after the FBI revealed what it found at one facility. Take the case of Jim Stauffer. He donated his mother's body with the understanding it would be used for Alzheimer's research. Well, it's now come to light that the U.S. Army was using her remains, and it certainly wasn't for any effort to cure Alzheimer's disease. She was then supposedly strapped in a chair on some sort of an apparatus, and a, a detonation took place underneath her. It's been revealed that over 20 bodies were sold to the U.S. Army for explosive research without the consent of the families. Now, U.S. Army officials say they had no idea. They say that Stephen Gore's enterprise deceived them also. Jim Stauffer is now taking Stephen Gore to court. He stole a lot more than my mom's body. Because every time, you know, you think about her, every time there's a memory, every time there's a photograph you look at, there's this ugly thing that happened. Now, Stephen Gore was arrested in 2015 and charged with running illegal business operations. He is currently still serving his probation. However, family members like Jim Stauffer say that is simply not enough. Now, since ancient times, all human societies have paid very close attention to what they do with their dead. And for families, trusting those assigned to carry out this task is essential. Caleb Moppin, RT, New York.